can't catch a break. So yeah. sad. All right, take a look. This is our Sky 2 flying over downtown LA. You can see a little bit of that haze, and that's because we do have a little bit more of that unhealthy air because of all the smoke from the wildfires burning, the Blue Ridge fire, and also um, the Silverado fire. But overall, we did see mostly sunny skies today. This is just a really nice shot of our city. All right, let's take a look at our current conditions. So today we topped out above average. We are still dealing with comfortable temperatures in the low 70s right along coast, especially for Santa Monica. We have some lighter winds from the west southwest, and then our temperatures were much warmer inland. So we did see those temperatures top out in the 80s. We still have upper 80s right now for Ontario and San Bernardino. Still toasty for the Santa Clarita Valley at 84 degrees, 87 for Van Nuys, 73 for Thousand Oaks. We have upper 70s for Long Beach and low 70s right now for downtown LA. We have a little bit of that sea breeze, so that's what's keeping things just a little bit more uh, cool right along the coast. And that's also going to allow some low clouds and fog to push back in just for our beach communities. We're going to stay clear, but our temperatures will also stay pretty cool again overnight as we head inland because that high pressure system that's building in right now. It's keeping the marine layer away from us. The warming trend will continue not just through the end of the week, but into this upcoming weekend. In fact, we will see some of the hottest temperatures Sunday and Monday as high pressure continues to strengthen and pump in a little bit more of the weak Santa Ana winds. So breezy offshore winds will continue and then again, cooler overnight lows. Here's a look at that high pressure system. So this high will continue to build in as we head into the weekend, strengthen. So again, Sunday, Monday will be the hottest and then starts to move off to the east as we head into the beginning of next week. But our temperatures will still stay slightly above average during this time. Overnight lows tonight, we have mid 30s for Lancaster, 40s for Victorville, 51 for San Bernardino, mid 40s for Riverside, and then for the lower elevations from the coast inland to our valleys, we're looking at low 50s for Camarillo, upper 50s for Ontario, and Long Beach looking in the looking also to top out in the low 50s. Highs tomorrow, we'll see a mix of 70s and 80s again. And then we start to really warm up as we head into the weekend, because again, that high pressure system is really pushing into our area. Halloween, Saturday, 70s, 80s, 90s. Sunday, we go up by a few more degrees. So we're going to continue to add on temperatures as we head into the next few days. And then for Election Day Tuesday, that's when we start to cool down just a touch. But you can see we're still staying warmer than normal in the 70s and 80s, but we're just going to go down by a few degrees compared to Monday. Back to you guys.